All right, Shalom. Shalom. All right, first and foremost, I'd like to give all praises to Yahweh, God Hashem, Yahweh Shai, God Hashem, Makar Kodash, Rakat Yahweh, Rakat Yahweh, Rakat Yahweh, All right, Shemim Kabad God Walla Rakaba, as a phone him now, or how shall Yakim now, shall Yashala, right? All right, which means double honors to the apostles and elders of the great millstone. Peace and salutation to you, Archimedes, that's pushing his truth with love and sincerity and in charity. Okay, this is GMS Bombers Nassau. I'll be back here again to bring you another lesson through the power and spirit of Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai. All right. So, yeah, man, uh, this lesson would be entitled Israel are not Israel. Okay, what, what I mean by Israel are not Israel, Israel today, but all that foolishness would happen in over there today. In the land of Israel today, that isn't the land that the Lord uh, promised us. Yeah. And those crackers would not land, okay, they are not the true biblical Israelites. Okay? You are came at Guatim Bobanium, okay, Saponium, and the apostles you all know what time it is. Okay? Yeah. So yeah man. We are today to bring you a, a, a lesson to the power and spirit of Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai. Okay, going into that, showing you that these people, okay, open that land and defile our land. All right, this is why the Most High ain't gonna allow us to go back inside that land. Okay, because that land is defiled. Okay, you can't take, you can't take something pure and put it in a in a, in a filthy place. Okay, so yeah, man. We can touch a few precepts, okay, and showing you and proving to you that that place is filthy, okay. All manner of wickedness is out there, all manner of abomination and abominable things are dwelling inside there, okay. So we can show you that the Most High, His word don't change. He don't change. His word don't change. His son don't change. Which His son is this word, okay. So yeah, man, we can get a first precept. We can jump on is Malachi two and six. This is book of Malachi chapter 3 and 6. For I am Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai, I change not. Therefore ye sons of Jacob are not consumed. Can you hear that? Okay. The most high say he changed not. Alright. He changed not. Okay. So you dumb Christians who believe that those uh, so-called Israelis, okay, because they are not Israelites. They are Israelis, which is to be like the Israelite, to be like the original thing. Okay. okay? But guess what? You're looking at the original things right here. Okay. You're looking at the original Israelites right here. All right? Because the most as far as we know, he scattered through the four winds. Okay? We look like everybody. Okay. We different shades uh, of brown. Okay, as y'all can see in the, in, in the camera right here. All right, you got the brother Kazuan, he's, 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 he's brown skin. Okay, you got the brother Yerame, he's brown skin. And you got me, I brown skin. Are we all the same color? Different shades of brown. Okay, then you have some even lighter. All right, like the Latinos. Okay, so yeah, man, you can get that next precept. Okay. Hebrews 13 and 8. Yahweh Shai Mashiach, the same yesterday, and today, and forever. Gun, which is this word. The same yesterday, the same today, and guess what? The same forevermore. Alright, he don't change. Okay, we can get the next one in uh, Numbers chapter 23 right. and show you how he said it. That's just what's going to happen. Right. Okay. Numbers 23 and 19. Yahweh is not a man that he should lie, neither the son of man that he should repent. Hath he said, and shall he not do it? Or hath he spoken, and shall he not make it good? Can. You see that? So the most I he don't lie. Can. Okay, whatever you say, you better believe it. Okay, he will do it. Alright, he can't go back on his word. As he also stated in the, in the book of Isaiah. 
But you're going to get that right now. Isaiah 55 and 11. So shall my word be that goeth forth out of my mouth. It shall not return unto me void, but it shall accomplish that which I please, and it shall prosper in the thing whereto I sent it. Can. Can. It shall accomplish. And it's in. Read that piece again, it shall accomplish. But it shall accomplish that which I please, and it shall prosper in the thing whereto I sent it. Alright. It shall accomplish in the thing which which he are pleased, and it shall accomplish it shall, uh, prosper whereto he sent it. Okay? So the most I say, he, he scattered the Israelites. Okay? He said, yeah, he said that he would bring them back in, the, in, in uh, our land. Okay? <laughs> And guess what he said, that, that when he bring us back in our, in our land, that we will have peace forever. God. What's going on in the land of Israel today? Mm -hmm. It sound like no peace over there. A lot of uprisings. Okay. We have, what we have going on around the world? Okay. Crown Royal, all around the world. Okay. Right. So clearly, the Israelites, the biblical true Israelites isn't back in their land. So who are those imposters? The, the Edomites, okay, Esau, Edom, Amalek, and we know Amalek is the grandson of Esau, Edom, okay, and Amalek is Esau, okay, so yeah man, they they, they uh, we can start off with, with all that filth, what we mentioned about the day, okay, a little earlier, alright, we can get the book of uh, Leviticus, I mean uh, Deuteronomy, yeah. We can get that for How the Lord say there should be no uh, sodomites, okay, no whores amongst his people. Yeah. But guess what? All inside that land, okay, that's where that's where that's where they, they have uh, gay pride parades. Parades, yeah. okay. Yeah. But but that's the clear distinction right there, showing you that the Lord ain't dealing with them, and they are not the biblical Israelites. Okay, and if they war are the biblical Israelites or were the biblical Israelites, then why they name themselves Israelis? You see? Right. This is book of Deuteronomy chapter 23 and 17. There shall be no whore of the daughters of Israel, nor a sodomite of the sons of Israel. Can you see that? There should be no sodomites of the sons of Israel. But they have what uh, gay <laughs> gay pride uh, parade every yeah. year, yeah. you know, using the Lord uh, rainbow colors. Yeah. You see, they if, if they could if they could reach that rainbow, they, they would they would sissify with that as well. <laughs> you know, if they could reach that, you see, they would go to the ends of the world looking for that. Yeah. Wrong and wrong and wrong and wrong. You see, they'd be like 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 the leprechaun. You know, the leprechaun he won gold. You know, at at, at the end of the rainbow. Yeah. So them, if they could go to the end of the rainbow, they would have tried to bung it up. You know, you know these faggots them go because many of them inside the land they faggots. Oh, yeah. You see, you know, get that next precept, Leviticus. Leviticus twenty and thirteen. If a man also lie with mankind, as he lie, as he lie it, with the woman, both of them have committed an abomination. They shall surely be put to death. Their blood shall be upon them. You see that? Right. If a man also lie with a mankind, okay, man with man, okay, you woman as well, woman with woman, okay, you shall be put to death. Okay, and we brought out the precept a little earlier to the Mosai. He don't lie. Right. This is the law we read. Okay, and he don't change. Okay, and this word is gonna go forward and, and gonna prosper. And this word don't cannot go back in void. Okay. okay, so all you sissy faggot people out there, okay, guess what? Just know that the, your, your time, you still reading, you still reading now. Your time ain't, ain't up as yet. Okay, don't think that, that you skip the hands of the Lord. Okay, you ain't escape. Okay, 
So yeah, man. We didn't think that. All right. Then we can we can uh we can show you now, cause we just touch on the filth part of the land. Okay. Now we can show you that over there dealing with the crown royal and and uh them taking the jelly bean. Okay. What they what they uh impose or made mandates that their citizens all the citizens uh get the jelly bean okay or take the jug all right and if they and if the parents don't take take it or if they, they don't let their children take it okay what they're gonna do is take away their uh jelly bean card or their jelly bean passport Y'all know where I mean by jelly bean? The jerk. <laughs> you see? So, the Lord said in, uh, in, uh, in Isaiah, okay, that he would what? He's going to set us back in our land and we will have no more war. We love no more of this and we love no more of that. And all nations would gather on, unto us. You see? But, Guess what? Are that happening now? Okay. Pastor Pork Chop tell us two, three years ago that, that, that we are only need the new covenant. You <laughs> see? So we only need the new covenant. And he quoted uh, uh, Hebrews 8 and 8. Okay? So we only need that. Then why are we still here preaching? Why are we still making videos? Okay. Why chaos in the land of Israel today? You see? Hebrews 8 and 8. For finding fault with them, he said, Behold, behold, the day has come, said the Lord, when I will make a new covenant with the house of Israel and with the house of Judah. Not according to the covenant that I made with their fathers in the day when I took them by the hand to lead them out of the land of Egypt, because they continued not in my covenant and I regarded them not, and sit, Salah. Because they continue not in my covenant, and I regarded them not, said the Lord. For this is the covenant that I will make with the house of Israel after those days, said the Lord. God, and, and, and this right here with the Most High is saying, okay, this is what that, that uh, pot of eating pastor say that already had done, okay. already happened. Okay, this is a, this is a prophecy ain't happened yet. Okay, and we can get this in, in the in, in the Old Testament where uh, Paul uh, quoted this from. Okay, we don't. I will put my laws into their mind and write them in their hearts, and I will be to them a power, and they shall be to me a people, and they shall not teach every man his neighbor and every man his brother saying know the lord for all shall know me from the least to the greatest all right you see that from the right. least to the greatest the lord says he's going to put his laws in our in, uh, in our hearts in our minds okay in our hearts not this this only pump blood right. in our hearts right here okay we ain't gonna be able to teach our little ones and we ain't be able to teach our, our old okay all will know the most okay has, has this happened yet? This ain't happened yet. Okay. Now the Most High, so he put his laws. Okay. Then what? Why over there in the land or, or uh, in Israel today? Okay. Why are they celebrating this this uh, gay pride every year? It's clearly that is against the laws which we read a little earlier. You see, their bloods upon their own heads. Let's remember that. Okay, they have bloods upon their own heads. Okay, we don't. Verse 12, for I, will be, for I will be merciful to their unrighteousness and their sins and their iniquities that I remember no more. All right, and this will be after we get this. Okay, this is a future prophecy, but it ain't happened as yet. Okay, so if, 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 if we have the laws in our inward parts, okay, then why? Why are we sinning? Pastor Park Chum. Why Israel can on the way they can on now today? Alright? Yeah. 
Verse 13. In that he saith, a new covenant he hath made the first old. Now that which decayeth and waxeth old is ready to vanish away. Okay. Speaking about um, 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 just the, just the, uh, the sacrifice which Yahweh Shai made for us so that we could live. Okay? Because if we would, back then, if we would keep on sinning, because the Mosai said he, he, he desired not uh, sacrifices no more. So Yahweh Shai had to come and be made the, the, the sacrificial lamb for one, once and for all, for us. Okay? For his elect. And Lord will, we hope to be a part of that number. Okay? That's the only law, what, what was basically done away with was the sacrificial lamb, the sacrificial law. We didn't have to, we didn't have to kill no rams and lamb and, and, and no dove, turtle dove. doves and all that stuff God. and go to the priest and let the priest make atonement for our sins before the Most High. We could just go to, straight to Yahweh Shai. Okay? That's why, why do you think when we pray, we say, in the name of Yahweh, in the name of Yahweh Shai? You see? Alright, so now we can get this where, where it was quoted from in Jeremiah. Okay. This is the book of Jeremiah, chapter 31 and 31. Behold, the day come. Behold, the day is come, saith Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai, that I will make a new covenant with the house of Israel and with the house of Judah. God, meaning the whole house. Meaning all Israel. Okay. All Yahshua Allah. Alright, the prince of the power. Okay. okay. Verse 32. Not according to the covenant that I have made with their fathers in the day that I took them by the hand to bring them out of the land of Egypt, which is my covenant they break, although I was a husband unto them, saith Yehovah Hashem Yahushai. Verse 33. But this shall be the covenant that I will make with the house of Israel. After those days, saith Yehovah Hashem Yahushai, I will put my law in their inward parts and write it in their hearts and will be their power and they will be my people. Verse 34 And they shall teach no more every man his neighbor and every man his brother saying, Know Yahweh by Hashem Shai, for they shall all know me for the least of them and to the greatest of them saith Yahweh by Hashem Shai, for I will forgive their iniquity and I will remember their sin no more. God. God. He was. He said he remember. He will not remember our sins, okay. But yet, those people in in Israel today, they sinning left, right, and center. <laughs> God, they doing more wickedness than ever. Hmm. Okay. All right. So surely they in the Lord's people, okay. And if they were the Lord people, all right, they breaking Lord's left, right, and center. Okay, which we know that they ain't the lost people in here. Impostors. Impostors. Okay. They defiling our land. Okay, and I, like I say, nobody can put something pure in a filthy place. Yeah. Something clean where filters. Okay. Let's look at go and look at your garbage outside. Where you put all your trash. Okay. Now take something new and go and put it in there. Something would, would, would you, would you uh, love or would you like, okay? Go and, just go and put it in the trash and then take it back out and see, go, go and use it, <laughs> all right? You think the Mosai is going to do it to his people? No. You think he's going to put his people, his clean people, after this law, uh, uh, after this prophecy being filled? You think he put his people in, in, a, in a filthy place? After he cleaned them up? No, boy, he ain't going to do that. Okay, so yeah, man, we can get that, that. We can get a net prophecy within uh, Isaiah, chapter one, chapter two. Okay, two and two. Read from two to, to, to uh, four. Isaiah, two and two. And it shall come to pass in the last days that the mountain of the Lord's house shall be established in the top of the mountains and shall be exalted above the hills. And all nations shall flow unto it. All nations shall flow unto it. Okay. All surely all nations ain't flowing unto that. All right. Not there. All nations ain't flowing unto that. Okay. Now they may be the uh, the leaders in the rap game. 
the R&B game and all that type of stuff. The whole music industry. The whole music industry, right? Dealing with, with Baphomet and all that garbage, Illuminati. That, that's what they did then, okay? But you don't see an all-nation flow into that, all right? We don't. Verse 3, And many people shall go and come, so like, and many people shall go and say, Come ye, and let us go up, and let us go up to the mountain of Yahweh Shai, to the house of the Mosai of Jacob. And he will teach us of his ways, and we will walk in his paths. For out of Zion shall go forth the law and the word of Yahweh Shai from Jerusalem. God, you see that? Out of, for out of Zion shall go forth the law and the word of, of Yahweh from Jerusalem. Okay, so has this happened yet? If 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 if, the, if out of Zion, which is uh, which is in Israel, okay, the law is going to go forth. Okay, the word of the Lord is going to go forth. All right, and keep in mind that all nations should supposed to flow onto that, meaning all nations, right, should do after what they see they do. You see, but what going out, out for out there? Gay, gay pride uh, uh, parade. Now all nations doing that. A lot, a lot of nations, I would say, don't uh, basically sissy in Iran, fire down all manner of wickedness. That's all we're coming out of the land of Israel today. Okay. We don't. Verse four, and he shall judge among the nations, and shall rebuke many people, and they shall beat their swords into plowshares and their spears into pruning hooks. Nation, nation shall not lift up sword against nation, neither shall they learn war anymore. God, you see that? Right now, they're in the middle of every every little room of, room of war. Right? That's good. God, they're in every little room. You know? Neither shall they learn war anymore. All right, speaking about everybody in this world, just these nations. So why are we here but World War Three? Hmm? I thought I thought these people are supposed to be back in their land. You see, you see? I thought the, the true biblical Israelites supposed to be back in their land. Then why are we here but war? Why we have this pestilence? Why we have an earthquakes? You see, you see? Why are we having this disease and that disease? You see? These are the questions with Pastor Park Chop, Deacon Bacon, and Reverend Ham, they, 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 they're afraid to answer. Why? Because they don't have the answer. You see? Let's get a, a revelation. Revelation. Uh, Gun. This is Book of Revelation, chapter 2 and 9. I know thy works and thy tribulation and poverty but thou art rich and i know the blasphemy of them which say they are jews and are not but are the synagogue of satan can and that's them people them there in our land today the synagogues of satan can who calling themselves jews and are not okay that's them all right the laws wasn't given to them the laws of the most high Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai wasn't given to them, it was given to the children of Israel who are scattered through the four winds. How we know that? Let's get first Peter 1. James 1. Verse 3. 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 Peter, an apostle of Yahweh Shai Yamajiah, to the strangers scattered throughout Pontus, Galatia, Cap Cappadocia, Asia, and Bithynia. Verse 2. He left the only one. Salah. Gene 21. Alright, Salah. Right? You see that? You see that the strangers were scattered throughout abroad. Okay? To the strangers. Not everybody scattered out abroad. Okay? Keep that in mind now. All right, Peter was the Israelite. He was sent to his people. All right, 
the Jew. James 101. James, a servant of the Most High, and of Salah. James, a servant of the Most High, and of the Lord, Yahushua Mashiach. To the twelve tribes which are scattered abroad, reading. Scott, uh, to the twelve tribes which are scattered, which are scattered abroad. Okay, showing you the Most High scattered his people. Okay. All right, let's get one more piece here. Huh? Get Deuteronomy uh, 28, 64. Deuteronomy 28, okay. Book of Deuteronomy chapter 28 and 64. And Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai shall scatter thee among all people from one end of the earth even unto another. And there thou shalt serve other gods which neither thou which neither thou nor thy fathers have known even wood and stone. Good. All right. So we are scattered through the four winds into all these other nations. Like we said a little earlier, the Israelites look like every other nation on this planet. Okay. Okay. In various different shades of brown. Okay. We look like Edomites as well. But guess what? We ain't Edomites. We look like them Arabs. We look like the Chinese. We look like the Japanese. Okay? Read the piece up again, Baba Kisha. Okay. <clears throat> this is the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28 and 64. And Yahweh Ba'ashim Yahweh shall scatter thee among all people. God. Alright? Shall scatter thee among all people. What, 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 what's, that, what's going on there? If a male go in, in, into all those people, Different different nations. Let's say it's twelve of us. Okay? Twelve of us, each of us go into a different city. Males. We get to meet a nice looking woman. Because you know Israel we like pretty woman. Okay. Nice looking something will get a nice shape and with all all that. Yeah. You see? We go with them. You know, we do our thing. We big them up. You think the child can come out looking like, like them? No. The child can come out looking like us. You see? Okay. So if we go with a white woman, a so-called white woman, okay, that child can come out black. A so-called black. That child will come out sort of like a, a, a high brown color. Uh, we call a mango like. Okay. You see? Same thing if we go with a Chinese or Japanese. You see? The child may come out like a like a like a like a warm color like. See? All right. So yeah, man. Israel today is in Israel, okay? Because over there, right? They they forcing the people to take this 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 uh jelly bean, okay? And all manner of, of, of uh, other stuff. What's happening over there? Just a big confused place, just like Babylon. Read the precept one more time, and we can get on you. Book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28 and 64. And Yahweh Bashem Yahushai shall scatter thee among all people from one end of the earth even unto the other. And there thou shalt serve other gods which neither thou nor thy fathers have known, even wood and stone. God, so there you have it. Okay, the two biblical Israelites are scattered through the four winds. Okay, what are they doing? They worshiping different gods. Okay, when you look at the Israelites, the real Israelites, the true biblical Israelites, they are spiritual people. John. Look, look, look at just look at the Bahamas. All right, what what do they say? Bahamas is a Christian nation. So called. Okay. So called Christian nation. Okay, they they always have God on their lips. <laughs> yeah, they have a Z for the Lord. But really, truly, they, they lost. Okay. Look at the uh, at uh, Jamaica, you know, a, a spiritual place. Okay. You see, the same thing with over here. Yeah, they have a zeal for the Lord, but they are lost. Okay. You see, look at the whole Caribbean. Just look at okay. a, a so-called black person. All right, they always have God, God. When something happened to them, 
They always praying to God. You see, you ain't seen no Chinese, you ain't seen no Japanese, you ain't seen no white man, none of them. But the white man, he believed that he's the most high. You see? So yeah, man. All right, so with that, we like to give all praises to Yahweh, Hashem, Yahweh Shai, Hashem, Rakaq with us. Alright, double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. Peace and salutation to you, Archimedes, just pushing you through in love and sincerity and in charity. Alright. Shalom. Shalom. Shalom.